Over the weekend, Robinson voters overwhelmingly rejected a $31 million bond for the renovation of the junior high school. Fox 44 Shaquille Omari is in the control room after speaking with community members about this decision. Shaquille, what does this mean for the district now? Leslie, some people I spoke to today, today say they're actually happy with the decision because the district needs to tackle other problems first. Now, one principal I spoke to says she's devastated and will look for other options. Very disheartening, um, just because we have the, the need and now the need is not going away. On Saturday, more than 60% of voters rejected the million dollar bond. Robinson Junior High School Principal Cynthia McCoy says she predicted the decision after looking at early voting numbers. I knew that we were probably in trouble uh, and that the actual election day votes would probably go along those same uh, lines. McCoy says the junior high school building is deteriorating and faces a number of problems. I would say some of the top concerns that we have are definitely safety, um, also in a security sense, uh, but also the infrastructure of the building. However, opponents say the district should tackle education problems instead of building problems in the school. It is a large amount, especially for, we, built, we spent 19 million a couple years ago to build a new school and we're doing mostly renovations and demolition. We're going to spend almost double. The buildings look neat and clean and uh, I feel like it's not necessary at this time. Now McCoy says the district can either wait till November's election to try for another bond or pay off existing bonds. Live in the control room, Shaquille Omari, Fox 44 News.